vaginal discharge. Normally, vaginal discharge is clear and white but it may become stretchy and slippery in ovulation period for two weeks after your menstrual period. A change in the color or amount of discharge may indicate that you have an infection. Normally bacteria may be grow due to different factors, such as acid level, pH, and hormones. Anything that upsets this balance may increase your risk of infection also possible triggers include Antibiotic use Birth control pills Douching Diabetes Pregnancy Stress Tight or synthetic undergarments other possible non-infectious causes include inflammation or irritation of the vagina from a scented product such as soap, douches, pads or tampons, diabetes, or low estrogen levels as in menopause. Symptoms You may notice a change in the color, amount or odor of discharge. A white, curd-like discharge that looks like cottage cheese is a classic sign of yeast infection. Yellow, green or grey discharge is usually a sign of trigeminous or bacterial vaginosis. Itching is usually most noticeable with a yeast infection. A dry, irritated vaginal lining, which may be particularly uncomfortable or painful during intercourse. Abdominal pain or pain during intercourse may indicate a sexually transmitted disease, such as gonorrhea or chlamydia. However, gonorrhea and chlamydia usually don't cause any symptoms at all. Expected duration Vaginal discharge from bacterial or yeast infections responds to treatment within a few days to a week. Sexually transmitted diseases should respond to antibiotic treatment within a week. If the infection progresses to a pelvic inflammatory disease beyond the vaginal area, it may take longer to treat. Prevention Your doctor can work with you to identify whatever led to your symptoms, such as antibiotic use, wearing non-cotton underwear, wearing tight-fitting undergarments during exercise, using scented products that irritate the vaginal lining, or using birth control pills. If you use birth control pills, you may not need to stop using them to prevent recurrent infection. Advisory The information on website, YouTube, Facebook has not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration or any other medical body. We do not aim to diagnose, treat, cure or prevent any illness or disease. Information is shared for educational purposes only. If you like this video please share it and subscribe the channel Divya Sanjeevani Yoga.